impacted technological development and social progress, outdoor beauty is disassembled into two parts, natural and artificial. In the end, which is better? Natural beauty suggests that it has not experienced any transformation, but purely natural. In the community, especially those with their religious beliefs, they strongly support this idea because they think everyone should trust in God's gift, but they should not be dissatisfied with their appearance or seek technological transformation because it's God's gift. The respected Chinese text on behalf of the people likewise support natural beauty because they believe that your appearance derived from your parents since our parents gave it as a gift. It shouldn't be deliberately transformed. Therefore, most people in the community prefer natural beauty. Artificial beauty talks about modern science and technology so as to allow themselves to be the object of their thoughts. Maybe some people think that putting makeup on creates an artificial beauty. Actually, the original purpose of wearing makeup is to emphasize the advantages of one's face and to hide their appearance in perfections. For example, if some guests visit our home, we will certainly clean our home, just like in those days. How can it be slightly mud like we we can also beautify ourselves by putting makeup to look more presentable? It should seem like cleaning our home to look it more beautiful. In conclusion, outer beauty, whether natural or artificial, doesn't really matter. Personality is what matters most. To keep the natural beauty or undergo plastic surgery is the personal choice. The most important thing is you are happy and satisfied with your choice. Physical appearance can't define the true essence of beauty. Always remember, a beautiful face catches the eye, but a beautiful song comforts the heart. This is beautiful with beautiful personality.